Every day, in order to be grounded, I do a few rituals, one of which is to read a quote by William Jewett Tucker, who was the ninth president of Dartmouth College, after whom this center is named. He said, be not content with the commonplace in character any more than with the commonplace in ambition or intellectual attainment. Do not expect that you will make any lasting or strong impression on the world through intellectual power without the use of an equal amount of conscience and heart. I'm Nancy Vogel and I am the chaplain for the college and the director of the William Dewitt Tucker Center for Spiritual and Ethical Living. I also happen to be an alum from the class of 1985. As chaplain I feel like I'm a pastor, right? I am there for people who want to talk, who want to um, explore their own faith or their own moral development, who need someone to listen to them, to, uh, you know, need someone who can support them. So that's more of a spiritual or pastoral aspect. As the director of the Tucker Center, I feel that role is I'm overseeing the programming, I'm overseeing the center, so it's more administrative. But in both, I feel like I'm doing the same thing, that I am helping students who want to deepen their faith or religious practice and encouraging an engagement across difference so that people can understand and appreciate different faiths. Because we're all global citizens and so wherever these students go in our world, it's important that they understand the role that faith plays in those places. Whether you're religious or not, I think we all want to figure out how to be more fully alive. The years between high school and when someone enters the workforce are ideal for that exploration. And it's not that Tucker has a monopoly on that, not at all, but that Tucker is being intentional about seeing how that exploration, how that development of conscience and heart can happen across campus and wherever it can happen to be eager partners with those other places.